Hello you guys and welcome back to my channel. My name is Nancy. Thank you so much for watching. Today is a very exciting video because I am doing an Ulta haul. Super super happy because I've been waiting for my package to arrive and it's been taking a while and I've been really wanting to use my products and now that my products are here, I am filming it for you guys. So yeah, this is my Ulta beauty haul and I can't wait to dig into it if you guys are interested in watching it then you guys know the drill keep watching all right so i have my handy dandy box from ulta right here um i did order some products online and i did buy some products at the store some products were hard to attain so i had to order online and usually ulta takes so much longer to get here than Sephora so I really do hate shopping on Ulta's website but I'm just glad it's here so let's just dig right in and I'm just gonna be taking it out from the box and it's not too much but uh, there's just, just some products I'm really excited to try oh disclaimer I did try on some products um, the products that I bought from the store, I did try some of them on because, you know, I just couldn't resist. I couldn't resist. It's, it's there while I was waiting for my package to arrive. The one that I bought from the store was just sitting there, just luring me to use it. So, I had no choice but to use it. So, yeah. <laughs> Let's just start off with this lipstick first. Um, this is an Anastasia liquid lipstick. It's one of their new lipstick in the shade Maud. You know, I just, I can't resist Anastasia's liquid lipstick because, uh, it's the formula is just so nice and the colors are so pretty so this is kind of more of like a burnt brown shade so yeah I think it's super pretty and uh, yeah I just bought it because I thought it looked really really pretty next one is lashes this is from the brand kiss and this is their lash couture triple push-up collection and this is in the style garters so it looks like this super pretty um, I have not tried any Kiss lashes before. I know, I know, I haven't tried it before. Um, so I'm super excited when they came out with this collection. This is a new style of theirs, and yeah, I want to see how it is. I really want to try it. It's pretty affordable as well. I want to see how this one wears and how I'm going to like it, because if I do, then it's very affordable. I'm just going to purchase them. I'm going to go in with this one because I did take it out of the packaging, and this is the MAC Hyper Real Glow Palette, and... It looks like this so pretty so it has a nice mirror right here and then you have the three shades up here super pretty I have been using this one like crazy this one in the middle it just goes on so nice I do not have it on right now but when I wear it it's just so glowy and nice so um these two other ones are a little bit more subtle um, which I really like to me if you really like that glowing highlight you can pack it on but the one in the middle mm, that one did it for me it's so good next one I have is another palette and this is from dose of colors and this is in the blushing berries uh, palette they came out with two palettes and it is in blushing berries and the other one was sassy sienna's and I picked this one up because I own the big browns so since I already own big browns I thought I'm going to get a more more of the berry tone shades um, and I did use it <laughs> I did I just couldn't resist it's so so pretty and the formula is so so good I really love the big browns it was really pigmented and um, there were a lot of fallouts but that just shows how much pigmentation the palette has so I thought that was really really good and these colors are bomb I've tried them all and I think they're super super pretty and I would definitely be filming a makeup look using this palette because why not it's so irresistible and I just can't stop using it speaking of dose of colors I did go and got this ideal dual it is a loose pigment and a primer in one I got the shade sunset so it's like this and then you have a little opening on top here and then you have the primer I guess is what you call it the primer and then underneath twist the cap off 
that you get the pigment underneath so you pretty much start off with this primer you put it all over your lid or however you want to use this product and then you just put that right on top and it just sticks on there for you so when I first discovered dose of colors these were like their hyped up product and I've always always wanted to try it but just never got around to buying them so I think there was a sale on this on Ulta that I got, I don't know if I, okay, oh I got it for $15 and the original price was $25 so I decided that I should just go ahead and pick it up because I've been wanting to try it and I stuck with this color because it's like a nice copper tone color which is my kind of style, my kind of colors. <laughs> what else do I have in here? This next one I have is the Smashbox primer water and this is in the collaboration with Nicole Concilio if you guys don't know Nicole Concilio you guys are missing out she's cool she's a cool gal I think <laughs> gal <laughs> I said gal when I first discovered her I thought she was really really talented like her eye makeups are pretty bomb she created uh, she collabed with Smashbox on their primer water I don't know if you guys know the primer water is like one of the hyped up like primers in their collection and yeah she came out with three different sh uh three different primer water and i got the serene greens primer water so it's a mixture of like lemon and cucumber and uh yeah i i've tried the primer water once and i thought it was pretty good but the only downfall of primer water is that it takes a while to dry definitely before you do your makeup spritz it on your face first so it can dry up your whole face before you start putting foundation on um i think that was one of the con of this but i really want to try this one i really wanted to support nicole concilio because i really like her i, I love watching her on youtube i'm gonna try this one out right now so let's just spritz it mm. oh yeah I could definitely smell the cucumber, I could definitely smell the lemon, and mm, it just feels so refreshing on your face, you know, especially especially the cucumber smell. I feel like if you have a cucumber smell, it's going to be so refreshing, and I don't know, a cucumber just gives me that vibe. Next one I have is from Ofra Cosmetics. This is one of the products that I couldn't get at the store. Um, it was an online thing only because you guys know Ofra is like an online brand until they came to Ulta which is pretty cool yeah the reason I got this blush and just look at it it's so pretty it's like a it's like a nice brown sienna shade of blush and it's just like a really unique kind of blush that I don't usually wear I usually wear more like pinky tones or peachy tone but this one is kind of like more of the browner shade it's browner side and this is in the uh, shade raisin and i got this because of katie um if you guys don't know her she is lester lux decided to try it out because uh wanted to kind of get out of my comfort zone on blushes you know i love buying blushes because you know you can never have too many blush and here you go see it's kind of like a nice burnt orange sienna shade i think it's gonna look so pretty on the skin it's probably just gonna make me so bronzy um so yeah i'm super excited to use this one the next one i have is from estee lauder so i have this kit it's a set includes bronze got the illuminating powder um and heat wave and the sculpting lips sculpting lipstick and intense nudes here we have uh the bronze goddess illuminating powder so <laughs> Wait till you guys see the inside of this. Oh, oh, oh my gosh. Do you guys see this? Wait until I swatch it. It's like a gold tone. But it has like some glitter specks on there. And it's just so pretty. I'm going to swatch it for you guys. I swatched it on here. And you guys can see that. That glow right there. It's like a nice golden tone highlighter so pretty kind of ruined the packaging now but yeah the packaging is so pretty it comes with this um, mirror as well i got this kit for just 45 dollars. i think that's totally worth it because estee lauder is like um more of like a high quality brand so i thought that, that was such a good deal and i couldn't like miss out on it actually i had this in my cart for a while and I actually missed out on this deal 
like it disappeared from my car and it says it was like no longer available so I was so so sad and they finally came back on and I snatched it up. I'm like, I am getting it. Next one is their Pure Pure Color Envy Sculpting Lipstick in the shade Intense Nude. You can never get enough nude lipstick, you know? And uh, whoa, look how bougie this is. The packaging is like, wow. Look at this beautiful color right here. This is like such a nice color. Let me just swatch it on here. Oh, it's like a nice like rosy tone color is this this is nude it's like a nice rosy sh like rosy color really nice so yeah it came with this nice lipstick as well i'm super happy it's not like some crazy color you know so it's a nice rosy tone which i probably will be throwing this in my bag and wearing it a lot on my lips so yeah 45 dollars kit you guys estee lauder Ooh, that's such a good deal um, and I'm almost done, you guys. Almost done. And um, I got this Morphe blender. Um, and it is the Highlight and Contour Beauty Sponge. And I got it because Jaclyn Hill is constantly raving about this. Yeah, so she always uses this uh, sponge right here. And uh, I wanted to give it a try. It's actually, like, quite different, you know? Like, these two sides are, like, flat. It's not like round like, you know, like the regular beauty blender. So I want to see how this one works, you know. It's perfect. I feel like this is going to be perfect for under eye for sure. Not sure about like my foundation though because I only use like like sponges for my foundation now. Like I don't even go for a brush anymore. Um, so yeah, hopefully this works well. And you know Morphe. Morphe is affordable. And lastly, I bought another Morphe product and it is... The Weapons of Mass Seduction Deep Smoky. It's a five-piece eye collection. You see? I like getting these kits, you guys. Five in one. Voila. So let's go into these first. These are brushes. And it's like a double-ended brush. And you guys already know more of these brushes. Two double-ended brush. Okay. So I'm definitely going to be using this came in with the palette as well so like a little tiny palette right here from morphe and just got three simple smoky colors you got your dark shade and like a brown taupey shade and then of course a nice like brownish you know shimmer shade right there to create like a nice smoky eye look and then uh, we have uh an eyeliner a pencil liner in the shade dark room and then this one is the one that i'm actually most excited about it is the morphe gel liner in the shade shadow so yeah i think they're raving about this eyeliner this gel liner and i uh, kind of wanted to see what the hype is all about they said that it's like super black and pigmented I'm super excited to try this out that is it for my haul you guys that is it um and i really hope you guys enjoy this haul um, I don't usually do hauls because I don't usually buy like a ton of makeup like this like you know out of the blue um, I usually buy it like little by little or like piece by piece um, So yeah, I really hope you guys enjoy this haul if you guys would like more hauls, please let me know Yeah, um, thank you guys so much for watching as always um, If you guys like this video Give me a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and I will have more videos coming your guys' way. Oh no, I am not going to stop. More coming your guys' way. So please continue to watch and support me. Thank you guys so much. Bye.